In light of the pandemic, another amusement park has announced they are remaining closed for the 2020 season, and that park is Del Grosso's Amusement Park in Tipton, Pennsylvania. This is the second park to announce that they're suspending their 2020 season after Funtown USA, and there definitely are some similarities between the two parks. For one, both Funtown and Del Grosso's have very short operating seasons. Del Grosso's actually has a longer operating season than Funtown. The park is typically open daily between Memorial and Labor Day, plus some assorted weekends in May and September. Del Grosso's does not have a haunt or winter event, and that is a pretty big reason why they may not be opening. Pennsylvania is doing a three-phase approach, red, yellow, green. For amusement parks to reopen, it appears the park's county needs to reach the green phase. Del Grosso's is in Blair County, and that county just turned yellow this week. It appears the criteria to advance between phases is contingent upon declining cases and testing, so at the earliest, it looks like Del Grosso's could reach green by early to mid-June. At that point, there would be a delay in Del Grosso's hiring employees and getting the park ready to open, so that may take another month minimum maybe? And at that point, it may not be economical with such a short operating season to try to open the park. Second, the biggest draw at Del Grosso's is Laguna Splash, the park's water park. I have visited Del Grosso's twice, and both times the water park has been packed, while the dry park hasn't been all that busy. For the parks looking to reopen, it seems the water parks are lagging behind their dry parks. This could be for a variety of reasons, but one of them could be the greater difficulties practicing social distancing in a water park. If Del Grosso's cannot open their water park, their bottom line would be sorely hurt. The third factor that is unique to Del Grosso's is the fact that the owners also own Del Grosso's Foods, a company that produces sauces, pasta, and other Italian foods. This is one of the reasons why Del Grosso's has such good pizza at their park. And because Del Grosso's also has that food business, the park's owners still have a source of income while the park is closed. So while it is a bummer to see Del Grosso's amusement park closed for the 2020 season, this isn't a surprise considering the circumstances and their short operating season. The park may not have any unique roller coasters, but it's a clean, well-run park with a large flat ride collection, with the highlight being X-Scream, the park's terrifying Larson drop tower. So hopefully we see Del Grosso's amusement park reopen in 2021 and continue to make memories for those in central Pennsylvania. What are your thoughts about Del Grosso's closing for the 2020 season, or the park in general? Thank you for listening and subscribe for more amusement park news here at Canopy Coaster.